Hello, thanks for stopping in. This is Tom, and this is Tom's Rear Room Show. And this morning I've been playing with something that I found when I was looking for something else. It's amazing how many things you can find when you're looking for something else. And I found this code reader. It's actually a RTTY and CW decoder. And what you do is you input from your shortwave radio to this little box right here, and then you meticulously tune it to decode either CW or RTTY. And you have to have an extremely good signal for this to work properly. And I didn't have it uh, hooked up when I first started the video so you could hear the radio. So I'll plug plug this in now in the line output or the earphone output and then of course that kills the radio speaker and now you can see this thing is trying to decode that signal and I'm in the CW mode, the Morris mode and you use this knob right here to adjust the threshold of the signal coming in and ideally you want to have these two lights blink. I've completely lost the manual for this, so I'm just kind of winging it, shall we say. I'm even using this for my DC power supply temporarily. I must have 200 uh, wall warts, but they're not marked, they're not categorized. I looked for about 15 minutes, couldn't find the one with the right voltage, enough current, and the right connector. So I resorted to this thing. So that's why we're here. So let me see if I can uh, adjust this. So it's trying to decode. It's a pretty good signal. Let me adjust it. And I went too far. It should be right about there. No, you just have to play with it. I'm tuned to the um, 20 meter amateur radio band. So these are amateurs uh, communication, communicating back and forth via CW. Every once in a while I get a word that I recognize, but it could be just random. If you see a lot of T's and E's, that means you're not tuned properly. There we go. Speaking. I don't know if you can see that or not. Speaking of Butte, uh, unless Bulletin maybe, Ty, now it's lost it. It has there for a few seconds. Ben, task with, see it's working. It's actually decoding that audio signal. And it's doing a pretty good job. So like I say, that is a pretty good signal and it's not getting too much interference from other signals. So there it is. This is, this was put out Mm, 20, 25 years ago by Advanced Electronics Applications, AEA, which produced a lot of peripheral equipment for amateur radio equipment. And this is the MBA reader. It's a model MBA-RO. And, well, I kind of lost it there. Again, the input signal is changing. It's... Um, 9 o'clock Eastern Daylight Time now, I think, which means it's really 10 o'clock. I hate Daylight Savings Time. Anyway, um, and like I say, this is at 7.028 megahertz upper sideband. So I just want to show you that. I, I'm totally amazed that I got it working, you know, trying to find some source of power, finding the right cables uses 
mono cable, not stereo, and then getting something tuned in. Up, up until I started doing this video, I couldn't get it to tune in and decode properly. So, pretty cool. Just one of those novelty things. Um, originally, I got this. It was given to me by another ham operator to learn code. And he was helping me learn code because I still hadn't passed a code test. So I'm still only a technician level and because I haven't passed the code. Although now you don't have to pass the code. So I'm going to try again for general class. And he was helping me learn the code. And I was starting to learn the code. And he passed away. So I kind of lost interest when that happened with learning the code. That was about 10 years ago. So anyway, if you enjoyed this show, please give me a thumbs up. Thanks for watching. Bye-bye. I can't believe I got this working. It's amazing. I hope it's showing up. Let me get a little closer so you can see it. Okay, so now I just heard somebody else is transmitting. And I didn't tune it for that person. So it's having a serious problem. Oh, there we go. Great show. So it's decoding uh, that other gentleman. Look at that. Purely amazing. Thanks for watching. Bye-bye.